Agency's Blow, the New York Blow Dry Bar, told HollywoodLife.com that Amanda came in to get her hair done on March 28th. She refused to take off her sunglasses and didn't even pay. Then she actually came back two days later and acted like nothing even happened. When the 27-year-old showed up to Blow, the general manager says that she actually spent 50 minutes in the bathroom before coming out to get her hair done. It appears that she does this everywhere she goes. Then Amanda refused to take her sunglasses off while they washed her hair. But that's not all. Her credit card was declined twice when she tried to pay. And when it didn't go through, the manager tells Hollywood Life that Amanda ran out the door with their hairspray. Quote, she had bad extensions and we were working around her sunglasses and extensions. We gave her a great blowout. We ran her credit card twice and it was declined. She was also trying to buy some hairspray too. Then she bolted on us and took the hairspray with her. Amanda was also reportedly staying at NYC's W Times Square Hotel and she reportedly came down wearing a different wig every single day. In Touch Magazine spoke to an employee at the W who says, quote, we found her curled up in the corner of the gym smoking with no pants on. On April 4th, Amanda tweeted, quote, I have an eating disorder, so I have a hard time staying thin. In an indicator of what prompted the bombshell, Amanda had written about 20 minutes beforehand, quote, I'm suing certain blogs and magazines saying I have a mental illness. They take pictures anytime I've gained weight, then write a fake story.